Hello friends. Today we will learn about measurement of things with different units of measurement of length. Good morning children. Good morning sir. Children, today I will teach you to measure the length of things by using the length of fingers as a unit of measurement. So first of all, I will measure the length of this chalk. This chalk is shorter than one hand span. So here we will take a unit smaller than a hand span to measure the chalk. Why not use our fingers to measure it? Then the length of this chalk will be 1, 2, 3 and 4 fingers. Children, did you understand? Yes, yes, sir. Now let's do an activity. Mintu, Chotu and Golu, give me your pencils. Come on. Yes, yes sir. sir. Here they are. Mintu, come here. Measure these three pencils with your fingers. The first pencil is equal to the length of my four fingers. The second is 4 plus 2, that is 6 fingers long. And the third pencil is equal to 4 plus 4, 8 fingers long. Very good, Mintu. Now tell me, which among the three is the longest pencil? Hmm, among these three, this is the longest pencil. Now look at the length of this big scale. It is equal to the length of two times my hand span. Can you determine the length of the smaller scale without measuring? Sir, the smaller scale seems to be of half the length of the bigger scale. Then the length of the smaller scale should be equal to your one hand span. Now look at the length of this table. It is equal to 3 cubits of my arm. Mintu, now you tell me how long is this table when you measure it with your arm? The length of this table is 1, 2, 3 and 4 cubit of my arm. That's right. Can you tell me why this happened? Yes, sir. Because the length of my arm is shorter than the length of your arm. Well done, Mintu. Now I will give you all a homework, which you have to complete for tomorrow's class. The homework is written on the board. You all should copy it in your notebook. Okay, sir. Hope you had fun, friends. Today, we learnt about measurement of things with different units of measurement of length. In the next video, we will see some interesting examples of measuring different things using different units of measurement of length.